Hi all, very good morning. Today our topic how to test the FTP request. Okay, today is uh, today this is our main topic. You can see the topic name is how to test FTP request in JMeter tool upload and download scenarios. Okay, the mainly FTP why you need to use right. Most of the scenarios, upload and download scenario purpose only you need to use to the uh, FTP request. Okay, that type of sites only you need to able to validation purpose only you need to use the FTP request. Okay, first of all, what is FTP means? FTP means file transfer protocol. Okay, file transfer protocol. It is used to transfer the files between two computers on internet okay files means that is uh, your own wish okay documents or zip files or videos or movies or bulk files okay there are so many ways right that is you not able to judge what type of files you need to transfer for any type of files you able to transfer you can see test the ftp sites okay ftp sites means uh, most of the people you know right idea the URL will be start only FTP okay that sites only mainly FTP example you can take to the um, any news channels okay news channels one location to another location he will transfer the files okay news related contents anything you will transfer otherwise as for IT companies point of view uh, there is a server administrators mainly most of the time you will use the server administrators he will transfer the files one location to another location or one server to another server will be transfer that one means here the person's only administrators right that reason he able to easily need to transfer Otherwise, some web based uh, application based only also you able to transfer. Okay, you will give the source location. Source means uh, where is available the file. Target location where you need to transfer that one. That location also you need to give and you can start the process. Okay, that is the upload and download scenarios. Most of the time you need to work. Okay. And uh, this FTP protocol also you need to use it most of the time FTP sites testing purpose okay after uh, this is from a dummy site okay just for our validation uh, demo purpose only I created okay FTP server site URL you can see HTTPS colon DLP test.com FTP test okay FTP URL you can see the URL only will start FTP FTP URL FTP dot DLP test dot com user FTP user some this is a common one or uh, DLP user password some encrypted password after how you need to work right you can see it's a client client means example this my computer only client it's a local mission it's my mission okay there is another one server server ftp server whatever you given right this one that is the ftp server the protocol is most of the time proto what is the protocol means it's a set of rules and conditions that is only protocol okay especially ftp protocol means it's a file transfer protocol right you need to use middle of the time a local mission file you need to transfer to the server that is uploading or reverse server file will moving to local mission right that is download that is the way you need to work okay that is the main intention only you need to use after ftp methods in jmeter tool ftp methods in jmeter tool okay first one okay whenever you can in jmeter tool whenever you add the ftp request right there is some methods you need to use the same request only multiple methods one is a download one is upload one is binary mode after save file in response 
okay first one get okay download the data okay get method is download the data server to local machine first one is get method is download the data from server to local machine okay that is download second one is put method okay it means upload the data local machine to server machine okay third one this, this two are very important one okay most of the time get and put you can use download and upload scenarios third and fourth one based on your requirement only you need to use use binary mode you are transferring any sensitive data means username and password any bank customer related details that time used binary mode okay this method will convert to encrypted format and it's not understandable format for security purpose okay that is based on your requirement only uh, what type of data you are transferring that based only you can convert to binary mode most of the time generally you did not select to the um, use binary mode right that time every time will be converted ascii mode ASCII ASCII mode means it's a general format you select it. whatever data you are transferring you are able to see but whenever um, you given to the binary mode right you, you are not able to understand that one ok it's everything encrypted ok after fourth one save file in response ok save file in response this method whenever you select run the ftp test it collect the all ftp request details and full f uh, and ftp full response details for debugging purpose okay debugging purpose you can use but load testing point of view do not use it consume more memory okay whenever you run to the ftp test right any type of test you can select to the save file in response that time whenever the request will be hitted to server right the request whatever server response will be given that one on the same time what file you are sending means uploading or downloading that data details also you are able to see but the main problem is example as for our testing point of view I am using very small file okay that file also it's nothing else just my name only i will mention in real world scenario right the files very huge and um, um, around 5 gb 10 gb 1 tb also sometimes okay whenever you will convert entire data and you will show to them right based on user load you will run each and every file will be captured and you will show the entire output to the in your logs it will took very too much memory every user okay and you are not able to run successfully that reason you did not select to the save file in response mode just you can check to the as for debugging purpose only in load testing point of view you do not touch this one or do not select it okay after FTP servers okay most of the times um, you know right FTP servers oh, first one is the file jailer file jailer not only for demo purpose in real world scenario also most of the companies you need to use it okay file jailer server it's also license okay and so many methods FTP, SFTP, TCP uh, there are so many methods it's available based on the license you will use it file jailer after second one I am working mainly WinSCP okay WinSCP also same how you need to work in FileZilla right same way only you need to work okay these are the main FTP servers or you can call it as F, um, FTP clients okay this is the main details guys how we need to work to the uh, how you need to test to the FTP request in JMeter, upload and download scenarios. Okay. Now you can show to you uh, how you need to do practically. Okay. First of all, you need to check this site, guys. Uh, maybe anybody is interested, you need to learn this one, right? 
you can go to this site just a minute You can see guys, this is the site uh, dlptest.com FTP test, okay, dlp test, just for testing purpose only, for FTP request, uh, you can see, FTP URL, ftp.dlptest.com or FTP colon double backward slash uh, ftp.dlptest.com, you can see, anywhere it's come, HTTP colon double backward slash HTTPS colon double backward slash but this site is called FTP you can see FTP colon double backward slash FTP dot DLP test dot com okay whatever sites it's available FTP sites you need to be able to test to the FTP protocol okay that purpose mainly developed to the FTP protocol after DLP user, DLP user this one, password this one. And one important boy, important point, this site only for uh, just testing purpose only you need to use. That is also only for debugging purpose. Do not run for the uh, any script, that type of thing. Do not run. This is uh, uh, original working site. You can see IP block list. Okay, due to script upload exercise data increasing cost host FTP server at block list has been added if you feel I am blocking IP incorrectly please use contact the page read me currently block list okay who are the people through any tool not only from JMeter any tool user to you can try to hit to this application right keep on through your script okay automatically that IP address automatically to moving to block list okay that reason just for uh, testing purpose only that is also de debugging purpose only use you need to uh, this website do not run any script to that type of one okay whenever you run right it will create the issue to, um, big problem to the site and automatically site admin will move into the block list okay after you not able to do anything okay this is the site i'm using um now you need to open to the jmeter just a minute you need to open Okay, now I need to open to the my file jilla. You can see guys, this is the file jilla. Okay. Uh, most of the people you know this one okay 
just I am giving my host uh, this is the URL Okay, whenever you connecting right, you will face some problems for as general testing point of view. Okay, just you can go to directly site manager. This is for um, you can see only use plain FTP insecure. Okay, insecure method you can easily need to connect. Okay, that is why I am using this format. Okay, it started right over TLS. Uh, you can use to the directly FTP. Yeah, you able to see the files, everything right. Yeah, now you able to see anything. Okay, I'm already prepared the my script also a sample script I am already created. It's a very simple script guys, it's not more than, okay. Okay. Okay, now you can see, uh, now our main uh, target is, you can see our location. Example, you can see this is our location. E colon FTP. Okay, e colon FTP right, you can go to the e folder FTP, FTP folder. You can see it's uh, my, this is my file. Okay, uh, F, okay, the file name called Gauri, the below data FTP test. Okay. You can give any name FTP test one. Test is successful for upload. Test is successful for download. Okay, now I will write this one right just you can save this one. Okay, now you can close right. Okay, now you are able to see right e colon FTP folder it's available. Now I need to create same this place also. Okay, you can see this is the local site guys. This is local mission data. This is remote. It's a server related. What you need to just you can click on this one. Okay, the slash only it's a server. There is a remaining path. It's not provided anywhere. Okay, just you can right click. You can go to create a directory. Okay, I am not giving anything guys, just I am giving same only FTP, same file path I am creating, okay, now it's available FTP, right, you can go, okay, now you are in FTP folder, okay, how you need to work the file transfers, local mission to server mission means, this is the local mission, you need to move into server mission, server mission to local mission, how you need to work, right, you can see, example, this is my sample file, okay now what you need to do right just you can see just click on okay this is the folder a folder or file anything okay just you can right click that one you can see there is a upload version right 
it's very simple you need to upload this one okay just click on upload you can see the file transferring is already started and i am already working this is the file location this is my file location e colon ftp this is the source file this is the target file slash ftp okay gauri it's already came right you can see the file is already came okay it's done uploading part it's completed now what you need to do you need to download this one this is the major task okay you can go to ftp you can delete this one okay now uh, it's still showing that just you can refresh that one it's now file is not available you need to download this one means first one local mission data you need to transfer to the server mission now server mission data you need to transfer to the local mission just right click you can see download option available right now the format server location slash ftp folder local mission e colon ftp folder just click on download that's all you can see now it's completed within seconds only will done right but in real time scenario the files are very huge okay the files are very huge that reason he will provide it very clearly where is a source where is a target it's available the ftp protocol you will use it right very securely you need to transfer that one very quickly will be transferred um the reason for quickly transferred right there are very huge server configurations okay there is a lot of stuff is available back end that reason any type of file example 10 20 gb um giga gb is also able to transfer within uh, 20 5 to 10 minutes only will able to transfer okay that is based on file length okay okay now files are transfer to server mission to local mission now both is successful local mission file successfully transfer to server mission server file will transfer to local mission now both are is completed okay now what you need to do right you need to use tool through jmeter okay how we need to work right i will explain this is general test plan guys very small one okay this is the thread group just single user i am giving you can see ftp request put method upload okay this is the put method i am uploading the data what are what are the details you provided right ftp request ftp request put method upload server name or ip address okay you can see this is my server name guys this is my server name ftp server name okay after you can see remote file location slash remote file location slash ftp slash gauri dot txt this is the file location this one slash ftp slash gauri dot txt this is the server location local file location e colon slash ftp slash gauri dot txt this is the local file location e colon ftp slash gauri dot txt after a uh, local file content you not required you can see it's a put method put means uh, you need to uh, send the file to local mission to server mission that is the upload okay after you can provide the login configuration username and password okay this is the username and password guys dlp user and this is the encrypted password you need to provide okay everything now you set up right now what you need to do same file only i need to send local mission to server mission it's a put method right just you can enable this one it's very important second one you already disable right only single user i am sending uh, you can see uh, maybe you need to add view results table also that is also best just a minute yeah view result table also now i added right uh, just a second yeah we result table now also everything will work right now i am using put method local file it's available yes 
local file location govri.txt it's available some data also available inside but it's a put method right you need to upload local file to remote file this location it's not required any file otherwise it's a duplicate right just uh, in server mission i am deleting you can see before deleting anything you can see this one disconnected from server you need to refresh that one okay retrieving directly using ftp directory listening ftp successful okay you need to see every time okay okay no problem this is the open source right keep on it disconnecting every time you need to go to the any test okay go to site manager and you need to connect that time only it's working as expected yeah now everything logged in right you can see ftp it's not available anything okay local file available local file available it's a security reason keep on disconnected guys you need to active only it's work okay yeah e folder f e colon ftp folder available gaudi.txt you can see ftp folder it's not available anything nothing else right now you need to run the um put method how we need to work you need to see Yeah, now it's running, right? Maybe. Could not create file. Okay. One second. Maybe what you need to do, right? Yeah. Gauri one dot txt. Gauri one dot txt. Okay. And you can save this file. Go to location. Okay, Gauri one dot txt. Maybe any duplicate issue, right? That reason you can change. Response message five if do not create file. Just ten minute. If the destination path and file name is not specific. Just a second. Now you need to upload manually. Maybe you need to see if it is working or not. You can see something is failed, guys. 
the server end manually also now you can see whenever it's active right that time everything is working fine but whenever sometime delay automatically it did not work anything 250 directly successfully changed mkd ftp 250 created critical file transfer error okay okay it's not a problem this type of scenario right just you can refresh the server that is one and second one you can best way can disconnect directly okay now you are from disconnected from server that is the status okay now what you need to do not go to reconnect go to site manager it's a plain insecurity method only you are selecting for current scenario okay in real world scenario you no need to do anything in this point of view. everything the file server admin only will provide all the details to you don't require that type of thing. just demo purpose only i am using this okay now able to see everything okay the target location everything is available properly same only nothing else okay now you need to run one more time oh my god still is failing Okay, first of all, we first can try to upload first. It's very simple method only. I am already check everything working fine after when I start with this. Yeah, you can see now we able to come right. Okay, same FTP location only. <coughs> Uh, you can delete this file. Yes. Now you can refresh. Now file location everything is working fine. Yeah, now you can see it's success. Okay. Okay. FTP request put method upload. It's success. Okay. Two hundred and okay. Right. Request. This is the this is the ASCII mode, guys. Whenever you say normal method, until you need to select binary method. Response data. It's not showing, guys. Security reason. It's not showing anything. Okay. Only file is successfully transferred. That is the first one. Okay. No. You can refresh this one. Just a minute. It's already success, right? 100% the file is transferred, but the problem is, is server it's not working as expected. Just a minute, you able to transfer the file or not? Gauri, 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 one or two will transfer one time. Okay. Now you need to run one more time. Okay, put method 10, 10, uniquely you need to send in red, that reason Gauri 10 I am giving. Gauri 10 I am giving. 
you can run now you can see guys now also it's success right 200 messages successfully transfer the file that is i am already sure whatever path i will provide you can see gauri txt this is the remote file path local file this is the local file path the problem is server only okay, it's not working fine okay it's not updating they mind everything file is 100 percent it working You can see now it's updating right gauri.10.txt same file you need to update server end also but server end it's not updating anything okay now you need to send to the file manually you need to transfer this one okay whenever you transfer any one file right automatically you will be able to see uh, remaining files anything will be able to successfully transfer or not uh, yeah you can see whenever you transfer first file right example gauri 1.txt also it's success only okay this one i manually i'm sending okay Gauri 1.txt also successfully it's coming but it not displaying to the server end that is the problem for server only not for uh, our request okay our request is working fine example now Gauri 1.10 it's available right you need to change the now file uh, you can change it to Android now also you need to test one more time Okay, Gauri 100. Okay, now you need to run one more time. Okay, now also it's success, right? Whenever it successes, the file is back and is already done. Okay, that is the important point guys the file is transferring it's already completed but the problem is it's not updating fastly okay and now we can see it's a disconnected right disconnected from server okay this security reason it's a keep on disconnecting right and server is not able to update anything but backend operation is already completed example whenever first time i am upload into the gauri 1.txt the file is already transferred but it's not showing after whenever manually gauri 10.txt i transfer right automatically gauri 1.txt also it's came okay now gauri 100.txt you already shared right maybe these two files you need to delete this one it's gone You can see Gauri 100.txt. It's came right. Yeah, Gauri 100.txt. The file is came. Now you can see Gauri 100.txt, Gauri 100.txt. Both the files it's available. That is server issue only. Okay, server is not working as expected. That much of fast is not working and keep on disconnecting. Right, it's not able to update the data on time. Okay. This is our request is successful, 100% our request is successful, the problem is server only, okay. Now JMeter, FTP request, FTP request especially put method, put, put method is successful, okay. You can see the file automatically through JMeter able to transfer to the successful, okay. Okay. First one put method is completed. Now Gauri 100.txt file available server end. Now what you need to do right? You can delete this one. 
local file you delete it you can just you can refresh it's not available right what you need to do just you can clear everything you can disable this one same method only gauri 100.txt Okay. You can see now FTP request get method. Get method download. Download means okay. This method you can download the server file, server location file to local machine, local file. The same gauri.txt file now it's available in remote machine. You need to download it to the transfer to the local file you can see the remote file location ftp gauri.txt local e colon ftp gauri.txt get method or e tr means it's a retrieve okay str means it's a store store means it's also upload only retrieve means it's the downloading that's all same username and password same get method you can see previously you can use put method now get method Okay, now you need to save. You can go to the server end, please. You can refresh this one. Guys, one thing you can see, still few minutes back also, FTP file, it's available, gauri100.txt file, but now it's showing empty. Okay. That reason the file, um, server end is not working as expected. Okay, but still file is available. We need to keep on logging this one, otherwise it's not working. Plain FTP is insecure. Please switch to FTP over TLS. You can see it's now it's login right. Okay, this is server and you can see command cwd change the directory okay 550 failed to change directory failed to retrieve okay but keep on you need to try this one Okay, now it's login, right? You can see no file, it's not available. This is a separate location will be created, right? That time what you need to do, just I'm creating the directory for FTP. Okay, you can see now you can, it's not available anything, right? Just you can go to my location, I'm creating one new document. Gauri 100 FTP FTP test you can close it very simple you can disable this one you can go to put method 
Okay, now it's the latest one, right? That reason you need to run one more time. Okay, now freshly is login, right? It's a different location, you can see. Yeah, it's access. Yeah, now it's coming gauri.txt, right? Okay, now file is coming gauri. 100.txt file server and it's coming. You can go to Okay, now it's remove right you can Disable this one go to get method Get method means you need to download this one put method is successful uploading is done local mission uh, I'm sorry Okay. Okay, no problem. First of all, it's a file only one file, right? Okay, gauri.txt hundred.txt it's available. Now you can go to local file, you need to delete it. And come to J meter. Put method is disabled, get method e enabled. Gauri hundred.txt, gauri hundred.txt. You can see local file location e colon ftp is not available anything server end gauri dot gauri 100.txt file available okay now you need to run to the okay, download method right get method same username password remote this one and local file this one remote file to local file you need to transfer okay now you can transfer that You can see the get method also will success right it's a 200 and okay you can see the file response whatever data it's available right FTP test it's showing okay respond the file is available I am writing FTP test right? same FTP test only available file is success you can see Gauri 100 is scale okay this is the way guys uh, you need to test to the the server file to local file local file to server file will be transferred for ftp testing okay this is just server end most of the time you did not get server permissions that type of thing it's not provided only provided to the local mission file location path will provided uh, by default uh, it's uh, your mission right your local mission it's by default will be provided server end the path everything server admin only will provide you will requested what are the details you require automatically will provide it okay after you can delete this one now you can see most of the scenarios there is a save file response i am already checked this one that reason only you will be able to see the uh, example one second you can remove everything just get method right guys you can see now i am already deleted the file path okay how you need to came you need to see one time it's a download method success right you can see my request i did not select anything use binary or save file format you can see just a success request and response response is nothing else right but whenever you selected to the use binary and save file format now you need to save this one you can delete this file also you need to get everything through server only okay you can, now you can run you can see both you selected Okay, now you selected OK, right? And request you can see not for ASCII. Okay, it's a binary. It's a binary format. Maybe your request is very too big, right? That time it's automatically converted to the okay encrypted format. 
This is very small and it's not considered. It's a very small format only when sharing. But whenever you are sharing any input related details, username and password remaining, bank stuff, any sensitive data you transfer, right? That time you can select binary format. It's a human, not a readable format will be converted. That is the first one. And the second one, response, you can see whatever file I am sharing, that file, what data it's available, it's showing FTP test. Okay. But it's a um, very huge files you transfer, right? Every file response you able to show this way. It's a backend lot of memory will be consumed in JMeter listeners. Example in view results tree also. It's a very huge memory consumption for base run user load. That reason do not use to the uh, mainly save response file. Only you can use the debugging purpose, but you do not use to the as for load testing. Okay, you can both you need to uncheck and you can run anything. That is the good method. Okay. Uh, yes, yeah, that's all guys. And uh, you can get uh, how much time the response will be executed there. Sample time, you can see. Uh, milliseconds, around 11 seconds will be taken the time per single request. For downloading, uploading also it's same way only. And JMeter, how whenever the huge file will be downloading, so how much of size will be downloaded, how much of size will be uploaded, that verifications, okay. The type of things my next video I will provide it. Maybe you will get the clarity. Okay. Uh, this video main focus only how you need to test to the FTP test. Okay. It's also very simple guys. You can able to test very easily. Okay. But um, whenever you are working any project, um, any server related example, Linux or Unix servers, example your application, the backend there is a Unix server available. Uh, it will generate some passwords okay or otps now latestly t o t t it's coming t o t t means one time time based password okay this is just unique it's the latest unit came right the back in any unix or linux servers working right that time you able to use to the ftp also it's very easily need to use not for the all scenarios okay Normal general applications also sometimes you need to use to the deploy to the everything in Linux and Unix servers. But the main problem is whenever you are using the specific server, right? That is anything FTP related, that time you can use to the FTP protocol and you need to test it. And all FTP related sites, okay, the URL will be started FTP colon double backward slash FTP dot test dot com, anything, any type of sites you are able to test successfully through ftp protocol okay yeah that's all guys this video maybe now you understand right how we need to work both the methods put and get methods okay it's very simple guys it's not that much of complicated but just you need to practice one or two times okay you also get very good idea okay whenever you get a chance right for a testing purpose for ftp protocol you can use it okay and uh, this all the details i will provide my video description maybe you can find it and you can easily need to use okay and you can see this is and you can see this is a WinSCP guys i am already working WinSCP file i did not get any chance okay just uh, i will show you witness same only same only same only same only they are just um, both are same way only will work Okay. You can say, see guys, this is only Vinya CP, okay. The lock symbol, right, up and down arrows, okay. This is the Vinya CP, you can see. Vinya CP is if open source, as open source SSH file transfer protocol. This is also FTP only. File transfer protocol, web dev, Amazon S3 and secure copy protocol, client and Microsoft Windows. It main function in secure file transfer between a local computer to remote server. Okay. If this one also very simple only guys, not that much of a very toughest weather. But whenever you need to use the WinSCP, right, you can use to the putty. Putty user to you need to connect. Okay. Everyone you know, right, putty. Okay. Just for connecting to the SHH mode. SSH. Okay. And same format only file jail also you need to work same way only okay 
um, maybe you can go to any images right you able to see maybe you can see this image okay uh, you can see guys this one document soft area win scp okay this is the way only it's available uh, this is everything from the your local computer okay this is everything local computer this is everything server okay you can see the slash only will define to the server only c user soft area documents this is the local file okay you need to transfer the files this location this location to this location you need to use okay this is same only guys how now you you seeing to the um file zilla server right local server and remote server path location same format only you need to go to the win scp also okay both are it same just uh, some little bit changes only okay but you can understand the how ftp need to work you can practically and what type of problems you have and one more important thing guys whenever sometime you will face this uh, issue also the issue is whenever you are not able example your put request will success you are able to successfully transfer to the local file to remote file but whenever you need to retrieve to the local remote file to means remote means server file server file to local file you do not have any permission okay it's not only uh, this is a locally installed right file jela client in server also you do not have any permission until admin will give the permission okay okay whenever admin how you need to give the permission right example you do not have any permission to the any specific file or folder you need to download it to the your local file you, you need to transfer that time you will showing to the the access permission denied error otherwise access denied error will be came okay whenever he did not provide any permissions how we need to provide right example you can see 100. gauri 100.txt file example just and click just right click you can go to the file permissions click on this one you can see read 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 write execute owner permission group permission public permission okay numeric value 6 uh, double 4 i am changing to triple 7 you can see everything will be selected right you can click on okay now i have full permission to the gauri 100 okay no problem first of all your file you have full permission right but the problem is you do not have a full admin rights you can see it's aborted uh, one second site change mode 77 gauri 100.txt right you can see what is ah uh, you can see another one 550 site change mode command failed okay whatever operation you did you do not have permission but in admin point of view yes you have full rights you are able to change that one once we will be given to the file permission right automatically you are able to download that one otherwise it will keep on showing access denied error the specific file otherwise um, file not open file not able to read not able to write the type of errors keep on came okay that one also uh, you need to inform to the admin team and you can get the permissions okay most of the time read permission only will given guys triple uh, 7 permission you never give read write del- uh, read write execute command it's not given only maybe you will provide read write you will provide it okay execute also sometime it's not provided maybe you request your manager remaining you can explain why you need to use remaining stuff everything also maybe will provide it okay delete permission admin also you do not have okay he never provided to you just you need to create it that's all and you can download that's all your job okay yeah most of the things i am already covered guys okay whatever details i need to provide right that is main scenario how to 
test FTP request in JMeter tool, upload and download scenarios. Maybe now you understand this scenario, right? How we need to work, upload and download scenarios. Hopefully, everybody need to understand why you need to use the FTP protocol. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's all, guys. This video. And uh, my last request just uh, uh, you like this video, please subscribe my channel. I will provide more videos on same channel. Okay. And uh, one more thing, thanks for everyone on support to me. Yeah, that's all guys. This video, I will connect to the, my next video. Soon everyone. Bye everyone.